Hello, my name is Matt Ambrosiak, Cloud Security Architect at Checkpoint. This is a high-level overview of how you can protect your Google Cloud Platform projects with CloudGuard Dome 9. With Dome 9, you can gain visibility into your cloud environments and achieve continuous compliance using popular compliance standards. First, let's take a look at Clarity under Network Security, a visualization tool. Here, we can click on any cloud account and region, and at the first layer, we can visualize our VPCs so we can see how our cloud networks are interconnected. Going deeper into the Google Cloud visualization, down into a specific VPC, we can see our network security groups aligned into security zones, such as the DMZ, partially open, effectively internal, and internal zones all of which are based on the configuration of the cloud security groups. In this example, we only have cloud assets in the DMZ. If we click on any asset, details will appear in the right pane, as you see, for a quick snapshot of the configuration. If we want to explore an asset deeper, we can. With the click of a mouse, we open another tab into the central management console to inspect a virtual machine, network security group, or any other cloud asset. In the compliance and governance module, I have compliance rule sets, which allow me to run assessment reports based on compliance standards such as HIPAA, GDPR, NIST, and many more. Once I run a report, I can explore the findings where I can expand out the results to learn more. The continuous compliance feature generates assessment reports automatically for delivery to email or other systems for ticketing of non-compliant assets. With the Dome 9 governance specification language, you can easily create new rules from scratch with the Rule Builder. Here is a rule to assess if we have RDP access wide open to the internet. To learn more about CloudGuard Dome 9, please visit Checkpoint.com.